Hi and welcome to my channel Blue Lady Thrifting. My name is Vanessa and today I would like to share with you a what sold midweek video. So we have a few items here which is an okay um selling point for me. I sell about um let's see probably 10 to 20 items a week. So this is one two three four five six seven so seven items not bad. So maybe we'll make up for that uh 10 item midweek for over the weekend but let's get started with this vintage left in china reticulated plate i put its eight inches across hand painted roses flowers it sold for ten dollars and eight dollars and fifty cents shipping and i don't remember where i got this because i have had it for a while but you can see the brush strokes there for the hand painted and on the back it says left in hand painted um and everything and i like i said i don't remember where i got it but i probably paid anywhere between one and three dollars for it depending on whether i got it at goodwill or whether i got it at the menagerie next up is this hager vintage art pottery speckled green urn planter vase four inch double handle it sold for $14 plus $10 in shipping and I got this at the Wapak Canetta or Wapak to um, locals in Ohio and um, I believe I paid about five to seven dollars for it it was an antique mall in downtown Wapak all right next up is this fire king um, oven ribbed beehive handled soup bowl peach luster it sold for six dollars plus eight dollars in shipping and let's see where did i get this i'm thinking i got it for about a dollar at um goodwill or the menagerie so not a very high selling thing i do like the luster wear my daughter's favorite color is orange so i'm kind of drawn to it because of that and because of the luster i do like luster wear but i don't think it sells very well Tell me what you think. I think luster wear is selling very well anymore. All right, next up is this handmade three inch quilted decorative Christmas ornament ball. It only sold for $5 plus $5 in shipping, but I only paid 50 cents for it in a Goodwill bag lot of four. So I paid $1.99 for four of them. I think I got two Christmas ones, Ohio State colors, um, red and scarlet I mean scarlet and gray and then a Steelers colored one in black and yellow so that one sold five dollars and five dollars in shipping then up next are these art pottery orange spongeware snack bowls set of two um, made in India and I'll show you the bottom here Al Alasta I believe it says there it goes Al Alasta made in India. Um, these were actually a Sue's basement find. So I'm going to be um, splitting the $18 um, sale price. And then the buyer also um, paid $8 in shipping. All right, probably the most highest selling item of the day, $35, is this antique Victoria Ware Ironstone Blue Pitcher and Wash Basin Bowl Set. Now it is smaller not full size it's only i put 6.5 inch by 6 inch but you can see it up close it's um hunting scene maybe a man and a dog yeah dogs and men i don't know exactly what they're doing let's see the other side mm, house all right and then i'll show you the bottom it's kind of hard to see but there's that um What's it say? Victoria Ware? Yep, Victoria Ware, Ironstone. Um, this sold for $35 plus $15 in shipping. And I don't remember exactly where I got this. I'm thinking the Menagerie. And I'm thinking I paid under $10 for it. There's this scene up close. And again, the bottom. Nice. So sold for $35. So that was nice. It was blue. You know, I had to get it because it was blue. I didn't exactly know what it was, but it was blue. All right. Last item is this Born Concept or B-O-C. 
There you go. BOC, Born Concept, Shoulder Handbag. I guess it's a Crockett, Crockett Crossbody Purse. It sold for $20 plus $10 in shipping. And I believe I paid around $5 for it. But I wanted to show you the inside. So there's the Born Concept in there. And it's all Born Concept on the liner. And then look inside. It's got these leather leather things right here i don't know exactly what you put in this but it's leather very nice i think it's leather i don't know if it's imitation leather or not i think it's leather don't know for sure all right well that was everything for um the midweek sales thank you current subscribers and if you're new here please hit that subscribe button everybody give a like and a share leave a comment tell me what your favorite item was and as always, until next time, I thank you for watching.